Joining us is the chairman of the Standing Committee of Parliament on Transport, Tourism and Culture, Mr. T.G. Venkatesh. Sir, welcome to Sunset TV and thank you so much for joining us. Today, your committee has presented very important reports to Chairman of Rajya Sabha. Take us through the key highlights, the key recommendations and the key observations. See, the, before uh, going to this subject, I wish to say that uh, our committee is very important. Consisting of six, six ministries, National Highway, Shipping, Civil Aviation, Tourism, Culture, Railway Safety. All, you can say, total budget, Government of India budget to bear capital investment, it is going to in this area, major, major investment is going in this area. So the committee, earlier days it was not so important. After Modiji government, this, uh, this portfolio has become very important because country's development depends on this portfolios only development and uh, if you take the railway railway billions of money they are spending for development modernization everything and uh, the safety also is important railway safety is under our portfolio so railway safety the railway commission is there separately uh, under the civil aviation railway commission is there we said that we should make it an independent commission we have suggested the Parliament and report to us given that one. It should be independent. Suppose if it is working some ministry, if they cannot give independent uh, uh, advisors, everything, until that it should be uh, the chairman should, suppose if commission gives anything, because commission also is a low level rank comparing the chairman, railway chairman. So we are, what we said is that you should give the opportunity to him before in, anything you want to ignore his suggestions. So you should give opportunity to the Railway Commission. Like that every portfolio we are going very, very deep and advising that one. Uh, same way National Highways. National Highways, safety is a, around 4 lakhs people are dying in this country, road accidents. And even buses have been uh, burnt because of the, they use lot of plastics and other things. So we suggested them that uh, the material usage of the bus should be different way it should be there, uh, where it should not burn immediately if anything happens, and uh, sprinkler, everything, safety things to be taken. So, and also the drunk and drive. If you see Singapore, they will give life imprisonment. So here it should be Similar one, we have to bring it to the act, we have to change the act, that one strict amendment has to be made. The another one is the drivers. Our drivers are doing almost driving almost to 20 hours, 18 hours, or sometimes 20, 22 hours also without sleep. So natural accidents happen. Highest accidents are happening in this country only, comparing anywhere in the world globally. So, Modi government uh, is improving the roads and uh, controlling this area also. So, we are supporting the government what should be taken when infrastructure, thousands of billions of money is spending. Naturally, uh, vehicles movement will be improved, vehicle traffic will be improved. So, some safety measures has to be taken. So, like that, uh, so many things uh, we are advising each portfolio and today we have Railway safety, I said already, yes. were submitted. And uh, one more 324 report were given. Uh, untraceable monuments in culture. Uh, culture means everybody feels that it is a small area. But the entire uh, country, uh, oldest living culture in this globally only, Hindu culture, India, in India. And uh, living still, Hinduism is surveying and uh, nowhere globally that uh, culture is continuing so far. So monuments, the uh, countries, uh, it will reflect only monuments, countries, culture, everything. And uh, its monuments is not giving any security or they are not giving number of areas. State government, what they have list, central government is not having. Central government, what they have list, state government is not having. What we said is arranging 
all over the country monuments uh, security will be beyond their scope beyond the, it is not possible for them to spend so much money immediately security safeguarding so give this one to the security some extent panchayat and municipalities yes corporations the security because they have the manpower they should be answerable for anything goes from the monuments so and also missing idols state government also missing idols are there under their control central government also is there they don't have proper list these things were highlighted them you should do it encroachments in culture uh, the lot of things so encroachment has been taken so that separate act to be amended in uh, my place if you see karnool where i live uh, one historical place is there uh, stone age art is there uh, stone age what i want to say but there no security guards are there right. i have given kept privately my my person has been kept there to take care of for temporarily same way some mon- some monuments has been covered by mud and occupied so some temples rama temple lishwar temple venkateswar temple in my where my grandfather was living so i have given one crow from my side to evacuate the things and to make a compound wall right so like this if you see one place two place three place we can do hmm. private parties cannot do all these things so we suggested them have a separate budget for this one so like that we have suggested and uh, the re- issues relating to road sector 325 we said same thing accidents and other things so many things we have suggested uh linkage of roads and uh, national highway to be earlier also is suggested national highway and uh, it should be connected to the ports it should be connected to the airport like that we suggested them right. and tourism places and also sub set committees have been established for that one under the secretary tourism secretary connectivity roads also to be done like that and uh, Yes. and globally tourism that also has submitted tourism globally the actually all over the world our embassies mainly the chief some places now i won't say all the embassies some embass- embassies the officers ceos or where government of india ambassador will be there they feel that they are above human beings they are not they just to do only one level of people they talk and leave it yes they are not attending tourism side at all some countries are depending their economy only on tourism and india is having a very good opportunity to develop tourism right. you can't find like kashmir anywhere in the world even better than uh, in anywhere you can say uh, We, we can compare anywhere in the world this is the best things we have kashmir and amon to right. example lashadweep like that it is so many areas are there that also we highlighted and uh, uh, connectivity road tourist terminal facility ports and uh, same tourism development ports also is very important they should take we said every port should have a tourist terminal also should be created right we have made a lot of progress they have made and also oh, our site visits we are making we have made a uh, andaman we have gone andaman is a beautiful place and uh, the international modi modi ji government has taken very lead in that area some islands they are giving like a five star people hotel right. people to develop that one uh, here like uh, Maldives, how they are developed, better than Maldives, we are going to develop there. Well, international airport is almost ready, but connected for the staying, for the hotel rooms are not ready. This type of uh, gaps, the committee has been informed to do it. It should be, total project has to be, go similar way, well, just airport ready, hotels are not ready, then airport, who will come to the right. tourist? Like that, it has been submitted. and another important thing is the our committee two ways it has worked generating reports 
informing yes, the parliament exactly sir yeah. that was the point that i wanted to ask on earlier occasions as well and today also honorable chairman of rajya sabha mr m venkai and i do has appreciated your committee in terms of meetings in terms of attendance in terms of the reports presented what did it take how was the coordination how was the cooperation from the members see you again again i am telling the, in this area is important is that our committee is a mini parliament and uh, everybody should aware that this discussions will be taking place with all the opposition leaders also in our committee will be there every committee will consisting of all groups of the mps all political party groups mps only ruling party will not be there so every subject will be discussed with red mail and it will send it to the report to the parliament so unanimous discussions has taken place what parliament will contribute more than that here we are contributing mm -hmm. parliament only the report will be submitted government ministry if they want some changes they will incorporate and they will pass the bill so the 90% of the job we are doing here again whatever ministry wanted they can able to right. so they can ignore committee and they can also put it before the parliament you are aware parliament discussions will not take place because of your cameras so your leader want to show that they are uh, they loudly they talks uh, and uh, they the contribution they will not allow because fight will be their opposition ruling party so the subjects uh, detail they cannot discuss otherwise lok sabha rajya sabha very intellectual people also there in our right. parliament so here detailed discussions will take place for our committees also ex chief ministers are there ex ministers are there central minister uh, well educated people are there detailed discussions will take place and we will contribute very much i our committee has a specialty is we generated different way we said yes, that officers some of the things has to be parliament should go reports and submit the reports and act to be made some reports what we are giving you you can give departmental action departmental action can take it just legion and go will not be acceptable you should take the when you convince you give a departmental direction i'll tell you the airports airports the flight cancel the fellows will be standing on the Uh, flight cancellation uh, inside after the security check because of technical problem the flight will be cancelled the security check will be over where they should stand right, right they should have a launch for separately for them when flights cancelled or after security check some launch should be kept for them all airports uh, they should have snacks should be given served them something should be taken care otherwise uh, it will be very uh, very pro problematic children will be there similar ones even minor things we have started advising night landing uh, airports and where the delhi fog will be there and diverted so near airports they should have night landing also so like that so many minor things also we, yes. we have gone them and uh, you can say that uh, our committee from 2019 onwards 65 meetings have been conducted in spite of uh, covid period two years and 51 reports to the parliament highest number right. and uh, five reports that i am presented today right uh, so this is the highest number prime uh, the venkai nadu ji appreciation also reports different fashion we have generated different way we have submitted more than all the things uh, uh, and can i tell you was saying if any subject departments have not been acted or delayed or anything uh, the committee they are again interacting committee committee chairman one to one right. they are interacting and completing the subject that is lot of appreciation on that subject Absolutely. also so like this the parliament standing committee best way contributed and all the committee members they are very very good and they cooperate in spite of different political parties are there yes and almost all the things are unanimous decisions has been almost 100% unanimous decisions were taken and submitted to the parliament this the great job has been done this parliamentary standing committee and future also this committee will contribute big way to the country
Absolutely, sir, and congratulations for all the hard work. But right now, thank you so much for talking to Sunset Television. Reporting from Parliament with camera person Sudhanshu Sahu, I'm Kriti Mishra for Sunset TV.